Ethereum is testing a crucial support level. If that sounds interesting, you make sure to continue watching this video. We are nearing 1100 Telegram members. If you guys want to stay updated with my charts as well as my trades, make sure you check out the link in the bio. It is completely free. Hey guys, me Charts here. Welcome back to another Ethereum analysis video. As always, if you do enjoy my content, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you guys are interested in 35,000 trading bonus, make sure to check out the link in the bio. And now, ladies and gentlemen, as you guys can see from yesterday's video, we ended up testing a very key support level here at 2866. We still have that bar formation on Bitcoin, of course, and we are consolidating at a very key range. And you you can see on ethereum we are starting to see more and more rejection candlesticks at the 3k zone it's going to be very crucial for the bulls to end up holding above our exponential moving averages if we are looking for any sort of continuation trade towards the upside now in yesterday's video i warned you guys to start looking to take some profits across the board because of the fact that we were completely over leveraged from a lot of our altcoins and we have been trading them since october that still is the same case scenario as of right now of course because again when you take Take profits when you've been in October. Most of your altcoin bags should be at least a two or three X. Right now, you can see that Ethereum is in a massive run. We have been using our exponential moving averages as support, and we have been extremely bullish from 2122. The problem is, of course, the fact that this recent rally we didn't see any sort of corrective moves. We pretty much use the exponential moving averages as support as we continue to push higher and higher. Even if you look here on the daily time frame, you'll notice that we still have yet to test our nine exponential moving average as well as our 20 exponential moving average which has not been tested this whole way towards the upside this is why i tell you guys and teach you to at least watch the higher time frames when you're looking for some trading opportunities because it will give you a much better understanding of exactly where things are likely to head if of course ethereum does end up breaking above the key wick high at 30 30 you can look for a potential scalp long opportunity into that zone but but right now is a time to just be patient and see how the market reacts for those of you that have been itching to short swing for a very long time now the main indicator that we have to watch for is of course a break of the exponential moving averages followed by a resistance retest and that's going to be your confirmation for that swing short otherwise we are still in a period of consolidation which of course does mean that we are just going to have to wait and see how ethereum plays out you guys already know i mentioned to you guys a 3k zone was going to be the main target for ethereum i mentioned that in telegram we got pretty damn close and we actually did end up hitting into three but we still have to pay attention to the wicks and how they play out i showed you guys in yesterday's video the dangers of these wicks and exactly the same exact resistance zone we're on right now where we saw a massive corrective move which is why me personally i'm just going to wait and see how the market plays out i'm not looking for any sort of new long positions at the current range but that's pretty much all i have for you guys today as always if you do enjoy my content make sure to hit the like and subscribe button if you guys are interested in 35,000 on trading bonus, make sure to check out the link in the bio and hope you guys have one.